Today we're test driving the all-new Nissan Aria. The model we're in is equipped with the E-Force all-wheel drive system. As you can see right now, we have full charge. You'll also notice that we have our trip meter currently on the screen, and it reads zero. Now, according to the Nissan website, the Aria Platinum Plus E-Force is rated at 426 kilometers of battery range. We're going to be driving this over the week and see how many kilometers we complete. And after that, we'll do some calculations to see how much it costs to charge, so stay tuned. We just spent the week driving the Nissan Aria, and we have some numbers here we'd like to share with you. As you can see, we drove a total of 308 kilometers and have a remaining battery range of 147 kilometers. You'll also notice that we have 31% of our battery power left. I should also mention that the battery capacity of the Nissan Aria is 91 kilowatt hours. My driving conditions have been pretty basic. I haven't had the air conditioning or the heating on, but have had the sound system on the whole time. Also worth noting is we spent about 50% of our driving in the city and 50% on the highway, just to give you an idea of how we got the numbers that we did. The cost of electricity in my city is 12 cents per kilowatt hour. To get our total real-world battery range, we'll take the 308 kilometers of driving that we did and add a potential 147 kilometers of battery range. So, 308 kilometers plus 147 kilometers gives us a total of 455 kilometers or 283 miles. That means our actual real-world driving range on a full charge is 455 kilometers or 283 miles. Now, let's calculate our cost of a full charge. We'll do that by taking the 91 kilowatt hours of battery capacity and multiplying that by our local hydro rate of 12 cents per kilowatt hour. So 91 kilowatt hours multiplied by 12 cents per kilowatt hour gives us $10.92. That means a full charge in the Aria would cost us $10.92. Now let's calculate our distance per kilowatt hour. We'll do that by taking the 455 kilometers of driving range and dividing it by 91 kilowatt hours. So 455 kilometers divided by 91 kilowatt hours gives us 5 kilometers per kilowatt hour. That means every kilowatt hour of battery gives us 5 kilometers or 3.1 miles of driving. Now let's calculate our cost per kilometer. We'll do that by taking the 455 kilometers of driving range and dividing it by our cost of a full charge, which is $10.92. So $10.92 divided by 455 kilometers gives us 2.4 cents per kilometer. That means every kilometer in the Aria costs us 2.4 cents. Now, let's calculate our cost per mile. We'll do that by taking the 283 miles of driving range and dividing it by our cost of a full charge, which is $10.92. So $10.92 divided by 283 miles gives us 3.8 cents per mile. That means every mile in the Aria costs us 3.8 cents. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to check out our channel for more great battery economy content. We also have reviews on other EVs, such as the Toyota BZ4X, BMW i4, BMW iX, Kia EV6, Volvo XC40, Kia Nero EV, Ford Mustang Mach-E, Genesis GV60, and the Chevrolet Bolt. If you're interested in hybrids, we have fuel economy reviews on the Toyota Prius, Toyota Camry Hybrid, and Honda Accord Hybrid. You can watch those videos on our YouTube channel.